Somebody fudged it up. Can't see very good. When you get across, go to your right. Let's say it's a boat. Oh my goodness, there's dragonflies all over here. It's at least, what, 20 degrees cooler? Walk all the way to the end and you have all this concession here. Jump across that five and a half foot gap. Not once. Two boats. We'll be back downtown in about 20 minutes. Yeah, I'd give it all up now. Did you just grab that moose's? I don't think this is keto or gluten free. Run! Run for the fudge! Low carb, low sugar. Somebody fudged it up. Oh man. I just dropped my fudge. Sometimes you go to uh, get fuel and they have these, but there's no water, nothing to clean your windows with them. So I always keep one with us and then get in the back of the truck, get my own spray for the windows, clean them. Sometimes the bugs are so bad in some areas that you really can't see very good, especially when it starts to get nighttime and then it all reflects. That's all I got. a little incognito we're gonna leave the big road mic behind and just uh, go with a winch uh, screen over the GoPro and try that uh, otherwise it draws too much attention <laughs> makes us even more nervous we we'll park down here the parking area for the tours we heard that the Upper Dales uh, boat tours are supposed to be the most scenic it's a two-hour tour, is what we're told, and the Lower Dells is a one-hour tour. Um, both not to be compared with, what is it, the Ride the Ducks or whatever? Yeah, Duck Boats <laughs> or something like that. You're gonna go down to the crosswalk, cross the street down there. Mm -hmm. um, when you get across, go to your right, up about a block and a half underneath the railroad, you'll see a sign that says Upper Dells Boat Tour Docks and a set of stairs. Go down the stairs with that sign, that's right where they're leaving. Okay. 
All right. Here's your receipt, and then here are your tickets. All right. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. $64. <laughs> Good Lord, that's a lot of money. I think we probably should have had sunscreen today. Oh. Yeah. Thank you. There's dragonflies all over here. Oh look, honey, two are mating on that lady's head. <laughs> say pretty close it feels yeah. really good oh wow look at this narrowing oh my goodness
two hours long, so if you're wondering, you know, am I going to need to bring something to drink, whatever, your very first stop at Witch's Gulch, you walk all the way to the end and you have all this concession here. They even have ice cream and brats, hot dogs, popcorn, a bunch of different things. So there you go. They waited for us. Those trees are on the very edge. Rock the boat, baby, rock the boat. Don't tip the boat, baby. Gulch to here, it was probably 10 15 yeah, minutes. Not it was really just right across to the other side here to Flat Rock where the dog jumps. <laughs> Jumping dog. Stand Rock. Stand. <laughs> I was just checking to yeah. see if she was listening. She doesn't listen. <laughs> and we got another area here that you can get snacks, restrooms, and, uh, and some souvenirs. Yeah. As soon as I could. Yeah. Two
you might have. Otherwise, we will be back downtown in about 20 minutes. Everything that I own Yeah, I'd give it all up now Just to be with you somehow Unexpected love was found You're the rose in a garden And it shows if I'm multiple boats that have different names to them. Ours was Joliet. J-O-L-I-E-T, not Juliet. <laughs> it did not have long hair. That was, that, that was Rapunzel. Right. Skip that. We had a good time. We did. I liked it. Now we're going to go find something to eat. Again. At home? Huh? At home? I don't know. It's a weekend, so. Oh, yeah. Good excuse. Now we're going to try a place. It's called Moose Jaw. Moose butt. Did you just grab that moose's uh -uh. behind? That's a disturbing shot. Okay, here we are at Moose Jaw. They had a gluten-free pizza. It's not cauliflower crust, but it is gluten-free. I decided to go with the taco. It doesn't look too bad. I just did a regular build your own. Uh, pepperoni, mushroom, and onion. It looks really good. Just a thin crust. You have an option of thin or thick. But I wanted to save room for dessert. Uh oh. You already know what you're gonna get? Yes. It's gonna be pie? Maybe. It's moose jaw pie, and it is peanut butter pie with vanilla ice cream, whipped topping, chocolate drizzle, a peanut butter cup on top, and I think I see chunks of chocolate in the peanut butter pie. I don't think this is keto or gluten free. I'm gonna try it too. Mm. Very peanut buttery. Mm. It tastes like Reese's, Reese's peanut butter. Mine wasn't so great. What do you expect when you get gluten free, right? <laughs> <laughs> right. Yours was okay, right? It was okay. Might have been the night. We've heard some other people say this place is good. So there, give it a try, I guess. Yeah. It wasn't as good as Monk's today, though. No, that was really good. Monk's was good. Very it's good. It's a Sunday evening and the place was packed. Yeah. So maybe. Time to call it a day. Yep. You're ready to drive. I'm, I am. Take okay. my pizza. Let's call it a day. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Click that little bell and hit that thumbs up. See you next week.